welcome back to the channel another day another unit to get we got a brand new camera we're using today a new gopro because my old gopro it just just kind of went out just started you know having a lot of jumpiness and the screen would literally just be bouncing all over the place lines to the screen didn't realize that i had recorded a whole bunch of footage i had like three or four units worth of footage and i went to go start editing some of that and almost all the footage is all messed up so we kind of jumped ahead now and unfortunately a lot of that stuff we won't be able to show i'll go and look through and see if maybe there was one of the units maybe enough of the footage came through all right i don't know though but we got the new gopro 11 black so it's the latest and the greatest the old camera um it was the gopro 9 i did over 300 videos with that one because i've got i think like 320 videos at the moment that i've done on youtube and the first few i did with my phone so over 300 with that one so we got a lot of use out of it and it just started acting crazy plus i was using it for my um, own personal use but we're at public storage inside we had to come up the elevator up to the second floor let me see if i can find this unit again that we the person showed me this is a 10 foot by 7 foot so not a full 10 by 10. um it's packed full 390 dollars now when they opened the um or when they took the picture of the unit they couldn't get the door all the way open or at least they may they didn't want to because they thought they might not be able to get it all the way closed so it was about like about that far open about half full and all i could see was just boxes and stuff just packed in there really really tight looks like good stuff but we're about to see so we'll see if we can get the door all the way open if we're gonna have to pull some stuff out but i think we're down this way around this corner right here i think yep right here so not too far not too close but not too far let me see if we can get this thing open but like i said 390 dollar unit All right, Ann, um, hold that for a second and let oh, me see yeah. if I can get it open. And I might end up needing you to hold, do something too, but let's see. Okay, there's a box. Oh, something right here. Up oh, under the door. Oh, Lord. You need to come down and go up. Okay, let's see. Okay, I think now we're we're good without falling at the moment. But as you can see, man, this thing is jammed full. But it doesn't go back as far as normal. It goes back seven foot. This is the ten foot going from side to side here. And all I could really see was down here. I could see all this stuff along the bottom. I couldn't see anything else up here. Um, there is some bad in here, like this right here is just worn slap out. But um, there is good like right here i could see this when i've been here's a ps2 i think it is ps2 this is this is a jump box maybe yeah electromate portable power supply jump starter inflator this is some kind of bedding paper bedding looks like a whole thing of cat food or dog food here um a crate even though it has a lot of weight on it here Looks just like anything and everything. They were doing some some painting on some stuff. Yeah, and this right here, yeah, we got the mushrooms. What is this? Some kind of wooden box. But they got mushrooms painted on it. Let's see. It doesn't want to open up. Grab that side. There we go. Okay, just a wooden box. We got the mushrooms on one side, and we got the Pink Floyd looking triangles on the other side. But down there, it looks like, okay, a floor buffer. We got an Instapot. All kinds of stuff. Looking right in there. There's a bunch of candles. So I think there's going to be good. There's definitely, you know, plenty of volume. Whether or not there'll be any furniture, you know, who knows once we move some of this stuff. As of right now, there's not really any 
furniture visible, but you might move this layer and then it might just be all furniture behind there. But we're about to, um, about to start loading this thing up and we're going to see what we find. Okay. Alright, we got the uh, Targus bag here. I wonder if there's a camera in here or something along those lines. Nothing in that. That's to hold like CDs. <clears throat> and it's, uh, is it a little laptop or a, nope, it's a little DVD player and 8 inch screen. So a little portable DVD player there. So I think there's going to be just a, definitely plenty of volume on this unit, the way it's packed in here. Oh, we got a taped up mystery box here. Um, I'm not really sure. I guess this is probably the side they taped up and I left the knife down in the, in the, um, truck. I'll have to come, I'm going to set that aside and when we come back, I'll bring the knife. Here's a big dog crate right here, kind of on top of everything. Here's another painted, something that looks like little trash cans. Be the change you want to see in the world. Okay. It's going to be okay, you got this. Oh, suitcases, I wonder if it's just clothes in the suitcases. Nope, there's all kinds of stuff in the suitcases. Coloring book, but it's all all colored. Here's some um, ear protection. We got some some breathing protection here with the gas mask. Um, part of a vacuum. String. Like that. <laughs> okay, we got um, some real chicken, or some, uh, no, they're oinkies wrapped with real chicken. Something brand new right here. What is this? Cartoon caption game. The New Yorker. Hmm. And there's other stuff. There's a Nike box underneath there. I don't know if there's anything in it or not. Um, oh, this is a tablet. Microsoft. Is this one? This might be one of those Microsoft Surfaces. Ooh, a tablet or something. Um, I was about to say there's not, but there are shoes. And they just throw all these um, colored pencils and stuff on top of it. But there's a nice pair of Nikes right here. So that's a good little box there or a suitcase. And this stuff is just just crammed in here. And then we got like loose stuff, just clothes. I don't know if they're put in there loose or if they're they might be spilling out of the bag. A lot of times that happens; they just start to fall out. Yeah. Books, a few books there. I'm trying to get where I can move something here. Oh, this is like a shelf. It's... There we go. Okay, it's a little wooden folding shelf. They've painted mushrooms and all kinds of stuff on it here. It folds. For some reason that said I don't want to fold in though. Uh oh, here's a guitar case. Is it anything de decent? Oh, I don't think so. Look, first act. So it's probably a first act little kids' guitar. And it is. So, nothing great, but it will still sell. The case is nicer than the guitar, I think. It's a first act, but it's a very nice guitar case. Vix vaporizer. That is a that's a common find. We get those all the time. Yeah. And kind of getting down in this area, it's just so that's kind of up underneath there. So we gotta get some of this off the top here. We got a car seat, so and a pack and play here. So there was a baby at some point. It looks like unless I don't know, maybe they put their pets in there. Some people will put their pets in the in the in car seats and in the um play pins and stuff. Here's one of these net. Whoa! Gosh. Oh, we got one of these like spider web chairs here. Okay. 
and we got another mystery box. We'll have to wait till we come back with the knife because those are taped up real tight. This does this doesn't feel like clothes. It's too heavy for clothes it feels like. And pet safety harness. And then we got a bunch of DVDs. What is this right here? A laser crafted product. Charleston, South Carolina. Okay. Logo game. Yeah. Got a Polaroid Autofocus 660. Uh, steering wheel cover right here. What is this little thing? Oh, it's a little. Oh, and it works on the light there. Some more colored pencils here. Index cards. Colored pencils and coloring books down in here. A journal. So mostly DVDs and some other stuff. Oh, got some seashells there. Here's an old book. Uh, something medical, common sense. A book for private, considerate reading. Here. Big old hair on it. <laughs> um, 1870. That's an old book. Disease, liver, stomach, and bowels. Chronic diseases of the breathing organs. It's like a little, I guess, like a little home medical book. Cooks tools. I think it's just a nice, just a nice little glass dish with a lid. All right, we got this dog crate up here, kind of clogging everything up. Let's see. Dog crate is in good shape, really good shape. It's a nice big one, clean, good condition. I don't know what this is up here. Part of a stroller. Part of a stroller. Yeah, we got baby stuff thrown up on the top here. At least they didn't throw the baby in here. <laughs> yeah. So probably, probably part of a stroller there. Okay, I wonder if that connects to it. The car seat, you think? No, I don't know. Yeah, that's a different color. Yeah. But you never know. Oh, sorry. Shell fell over. All right, here's the playpen. And this goes to something. All baby, baby supplies up here. Jacked it. Yeah. Jacked it. Yeah, that thing's just completely coming apart. Just like this one right here, completely coming apart. Few more DVDs. Horrible bosses. Okay, <laughs> Anne said that's uh, that must be like her biography of her, of her life. Horrible bosses. All right. Yeah, the top section up here is kind of everything's kind of just thrown up here. A lot of bags of clothes and baby stuff, and then everything down in here looks more you know stacked up. But up here is definitely kind of a big donut mess. What is it? I think there might be a big nutcracker here. I just noticed this big wooden base. I don't know. Here's a little Coleman pump. And as you can see, this stuff is not stacking very well because it's not... Everything on the top was just suitcases, bags, and just random mishmash of stuff here. Little umbrella, brand new Daisy Mark Jacobs umbrella. Here's another purse, um, fake Louis Vuitton here. 
pretty sure it's fake, yeah. Something inside of it. It's got the... What'd you find in a car mat covered in dog hair? That sounds interesting. Huh? <laughs> what is this? this? This was uh, some kind of toy, I think. But down in here, there's some Tommy Bahama. The thing's almost full. Tommy Bahama perfume. Colors of the world markers. Okay. Oh, it's supposed to represent it's different skin tones from white to black and everything in between. Wait a minute, found some money in. What Yay. is this? Japanese something? It says Japanese something on it. Let's see. Get, get it open here. It's the Japanese government 10 pesos. Um, what is this? I don't know what this one, this side is. And then there's some coins in here. I didn't know they use pesos in, in Japan. This box is already open. It's not taped up. And ooh, what do we have here? There's an Xbox headphone box, but it's empty. Here is an Xbox controller box that is empty. Um, oh. We got Xbox One Rainbow Siege. And no, that's dis that's dishonored. This is Fallout 4. Skyrim, that's not in there. There's Fallout 4. So that goes in here. maybe an xbox one in here also and then this thing right here is just tons and tons of let's see dvds maybe the mummy snow buddies the holiday yeah these are all dvds and there's no cases though so they're a little bit scratched up but as you can see them, there's tons and tons of them maybe the xbox maybe it's in here somewhere and we'll come across it One more box here I'm going to look in, and then we'll probably head on down to the truck with this stuff. We just got some stuff just kind of thrown on top. Here's some Birkenstocks. Is there anything in here I can look at, or just some shoes thrown on top? Is this a phone box? I think it was. I don't think there's no, nothing in there. People love to keep their phone boxes okay so just some clothes another phone box and just some mixed up shoes kind of just thrown on there here's another phone box so like three phone boxes in this box oh we'll do one more box here this one's got duct tape on it so we can pull this off easy and as you can see there's just a lot of stuff stacked up underneath this top layer up here Oh, there's a North Face backpack up there. Looks from right here, looks pretty decent. Yeah. This box here, what do we got? Oh, we got some Converse All Stars, and they're really clean. Here's a purse. It's got some. It feels like makeup, man. Open that up and see what you can find. Here's a Christmas box. Um, Christmas cards. Okay, so she says it's full of chapstick over there, and then a pair of binoculars. Night Hero, they're like night vision binoculars. I think you put a battery in there and then maybe that button there, it would have like a night vision mode. What's underneath here? Another old book maybe? This is A Man Called Peter. Looks old, but not anywhere as old as that other one. And a little, okay, a magnetic chest set. And something else, what is this? Oh, is there some video games or what's in here? Oh, no, this is art stuff. Oh, it's falling out on me. Art pencils. And all that kind of stuff. But yeah, 
So basically in this unit, it looks like not a lot of like big, really looks like pretty much no furniture or real big items. But when you start digging through, there is a lot of junk, there's some trash, but there's a lot of good little items. Just a lot of them mixed throughout from what we're seeing so far. Oh, I think there's actually two. Now I can see there's another nutcracker here. Oh, That's because I kept wondering like, what is this right here? But it's the top of the nutcracker's hat. And then here's another nutcracker facing that way. Oh, I forgot to bring the knife. I didn't think about it either until just now. It's a little late, huh? Yeah, it's alright. We'll, we'll hold them until we come back again. All right, we took one load down. We still got a whole bunch of stuff to go here. And I forgot the knife, so we'll wait on those until next time. We have a beautiful wolf poster. Wow. Project. Beautiful. Up oh, stroller, the more, like I said more baby stuff. Lots of baby stuff up on the top here. This looks pretty, pretty decent. Baby stuff, not something I care at all about getting and trying to sell but it'll sell it's usually show, yeah there's a nice little rug actually this looks like a um like a handmade rug here it's nice and thick some of these can be pretty expensive on these nice rugs like this persian rug maybe it's forever 21 yeah that, it's not leather then because their, their stuff's cheap but it's a nice little jacket yeah. still oh and you finish loading this, I'm going to be busy for the next few hours. Oh, there you Playing go. Playing this game right here. I know, you can do that. I can, I've tried before. It's very difficult. Here we go. Almost. One more. I thought that was going to be it. Oh, I had it. So close, yeah. Okay. That's enough of that. We'll be here forever. I might have got it on the next one, but who knows. We got more loose stuff. So, um, here, just set the loose stuff in a pile over here, and hopefully maybe we'll find a box or something that has some room. Like, actually, right there, there's some room. Yeah. Okay. yeah. All right, let's see. On top of the... That... Oh, there's a little wall decor. It's funny. We got the same thing at home, except for ours is a bunch bigger with this, with the oak tree. And yeah, it's like ours is like three times as big as this one. Anyway, some new little decor there. Let me get this box. We could put a few loose things in it. It looks like, it looks like there's some room. Let's see what's in it first before we pile on it though. What is this? What is it? It's an ornament. It's a ballet Christmas ornament. But there's a little box down here. Is this a sewing box or a jewelry box? Yeah. You think it's jewelry? Oh, it's jewelry, but is it anything good? There's um, a lot of nice, a lot of clip-on earrings. Lots of clip-on earrings. Look at these things. I think it's pretty much all clip-on earrings in here. A nice little box, some nice stuff. I'd probably just put this whole thing in our auction and just sell them all together. Yeah architectural digest there's a family bible down in the bottom there and if we move okay that's closed closed but what is it okay it's a shoe oh wait a minute there is something hidden down here you never know what's hidden in the bottom of these boxes do what the bag has got something in it okay so what is this official inaugural medal george w bush Oh, this is it. <laughs> okay, so it's like a little, I see now, Bush and Cheney, and then it stands on that little stand. I thought this was like the actual, like a case that yeah. something else was in, but that's, that is the thing. All right, so a little collectible item there. And this, some kind of a necklace. Um, I don't know if that's anything. It doesn't really look silver, but prism. Okay, inauguration, same thing. It's a 2005 inauguration little glass prism thing. Okay. Maybe. All right, so we got a little room there to put a few things in, like starting with this right here. And then the stuff Ian's got. 
little coffee grinder. So lots of good stuff just kind of all over the place. The, this is, um, does that go on that? Can I, cause it kind of just falls down there. It looks like there's something missing maybe, I don't know. I haven't seen any other pieces to this, but. OBG, Los Angeles. Charlie Brown Christmas. And then these look pretty much new. OBG, I don't really know nothing about those. Oh, here's the price. Oh, they were only $24.99 at Macy's, so not real expensive. But still a nice little pair of shoes. Oh, Case Logic. What do we have in here? DVDs, CDs, or video games. There's a DVD, DVD, lots of DVDs. Castaway, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, Captain Phillips. It says Kenneth Cole, but I'm not good at figuring out. Kenneth Cole. Yeah, nice clean little Kenneth Cole like purse slash bag. Uh, Logitech keyboard. I guess that's one for a tablet. The tablet yeah. like stands yeah. stands up in there. Feel a box. Let me get this down. Let me get these nutcrackers out. Oh wow, yeah, nice pair of feelers in there. Look like looks like they might have worn them once, or maybe they just tried them on and yeah, walked around because they're just yeah. barely a little bit of dirt on the bottom. Clothes in there. Oh, I'll get the pot down here. Oh, there we go. Nice little pot, and now I can get these nutcrackers down because they're kind of laying across everything here. Oh, these things are big. Man, these things are like probably about five feet tall, maybe. And I guess, and I think they match. It's just a, it's a matching set here. Whoa. Yeah, these would look these would look really good near somebody's front door, like Ann just said. This one needs a little tightening down the bottom. He's wanting to lean down at the bottom of his leg. He's got, his ankles are weak. Needs a little strengthening there. Oh, look, Ann, another wolf picture. That one's better. Man, look at this thing. That's it. That's a real find right there on the wolf picture. Yeah. Man, oh man. You got a little neck massager. And man, there's there's a ton of stuff in here. It looks like when you get kind of down, the further down we get, there's more boxes and stuff. I see boxes just stacked up. Look right here, a Mickey Mouse chocolate fountain. You think there's any chocolate still in there? We could dip some strawberries in. Oh, a poster. Well, and didn't sound too excited about, even if there was chocolate yeah, in there. I, I don't like old chocolate. It's a frozen oh. poster. Oh yeah. And there's another one here, what is this? Doggy digits. Hmm. It's nice right here. Six quart Dutch oven cast iron. And then right here we got Vera Bradley placemats. Some kind of pet items. We got pet stuff. We got baby stuff. And then we got stuff that's neither one of those. Not pet or baby. Clothes. I'm not really looking at the clothes because I mean what from what I can see, they're all just kind of they're not in there really neat. So it wouldn't be, I don't think it'd be worth really looking through there and even as of right now I'm looking at it. Oh, and there is a mattress. There's a mattress right here. It's all wrapped up. Maybe it's a good one. We got just kind of some random shoes laying around here. Oh, here's a small piece of furniture, an ottoman, but it looks like it's kind of nicked up there. But over here, here's the Mickey Mouse chocolate fountain. Underneath it, this looks like maybe a set of clippers. Is it clippers? Yep. Oh, they're dog clippers. You know how I know that, Ann? Dog Because there's a picture of a dog on the clippers. Oh, well, there you go. So I'm pretty sure that means they're dog clippers. Oh, here's a um, blood pressure monitor. Nice digital one, yep. Omron. What is here? Skechers Active. And they're in there, and they're pretty much new. There's another item over here stacked up. It's a Sony streaming player. Sony Stream, I don't really know. 
what you how what you'd use that for. I mean, I guess it's kind of like a Roku thing, but a Sony one. There's some more boxes back there. What is it? I'm trying to get to this? What is that? Oh, that's just like a little like baking mat. And I think this is a for a coffee maker, maybe. Yep, it's in there. Shoe Dazzle. We got some nice boots here from Shoe Dazzle. What kind of purse is this? It's got a big old smudge on it, though. Mm -hmm. It's a Calvin Klein. Yeah, Calvin Klein purse. What's this? Uh oh, here's some Oneida. Okay, it's a little um, baby set. Oh, okay. Oneida baby set. And we got some checks here. So it says, no, nope. um, like Christmas something. Oh, here's a shark. Looks like a shark robot vacuum. Oh, the smartphone projector. I've gotten this thing before. It's kind of cool. It looks like an old projector, but you connect your phone to it and project on the wall. I think is the way it's supposed to work. Oh, here's the coffee mugs. There's a Campbell's. That's a different looking Campbell's. Campbell's pea soup. Yes. It's not the normal one that we get all the time. Some candles. Pumpkin. The perfect autumn pumpkin travel candle. Oh, and that smells good. Here, smell it through YouTube's new smelling feature. Put your face up to the screen, press your nose like as hard as you can against the screen till you put smudges on it and sniff, and you will smell this okay. candle. Smell it in there, yeah. Does smell good. See, Ann likes it, it too. Smell so, good. smell your screen. I promise you, you can smell it. Ann, do you like peanut butter? Sometimes. Sometimes. One, two, three. Four, five things of peanut butter, and look, one thing of Welch's grape jelly. So you, they like to make peanut butter and peanut butter and peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. You want some? No. All right. Man, look at all the candles in here. There's a Yankee candle, balsam and cedar. Opal House, there's all kinds of candles. Many of them have never been burned either. Brand new. There are more Yankee ones down in there. Grandma's Kitchen. And I bet this thing smells good. Pumpkin roll, apple crisp, and pecan pie. Yep, that's a good smelling one there. But there's all kinds. This thing is loaded down with candles. Candles sell good. At least the ones that um, Leah didn't take. But look at this. I just noticed. Look at this mug here. Oh, it's like a man. skeleton mug. This is cool. Yep. That is cool. And then we got one little, some kind of Nerf gun thrown in there. What is that? Oh, you got the remote control candles over there. It's a piggy bank, Ann. Or it's a... Oh, reindeer hmm. bank. Oh. oh, there's a... I can see a dollar bill in there and a couple pennies. There but there's a cool... What is this right here? There's a, like a... Leaded glass box here. This is cool. With a pair of sunglasses in it. Yeah, I just noticed that too. When I was looking at there's a jewelry box box back there. I don't see any jewelry falling out though. So, and it's I don't know if there's any in there because. Pretty much, pretty much empty. 